right, guys, so we're looking at about, I don't know, a week of stubble here, maybe two weeks around the goatee. And I'm ready to shave. I'm probably gonna keep the goatee at least till the weekend. This length of stubble is always a problem for the multi-blade, a clogging problem waiting to happen. And if you have this problem, I've got the hack for you. Now, the first thing you want to do is you want to stick to foams. Stay away from the oil-based creams and you want to foam up when you're using a multi-blade, especially anything past three blades. You really want to go with a foam. I'm using today Barbasol's scent free or unscented shaving foam and that'll help reduce clog. Now I have the Quattro from Schick, notorious for clogging. It's really the only downside of this razor. It's got a beautiful design. It's uh, hefty enough. So it's got like a brushed metal shaft here, but you've got rubber bits on either side. So it's not slippy. It's got this wedge shaped you can see that, like that wedge-shaped head, good pivot to it, lots of protection with a lube strip, rubber guides around. And if you can see there, little bands, vertical bands that hold those four blades sort of a, away from the face to eliminate irritation. But I think those bands actually promote the clogging. But you can pull your quattro back out, guys, because I have just the hack to keep it unclogged. I'm going to load this up and show you that you can get that nice, smooth shave, even with long stubble. See how it's clogged? Now, here's the workaround. You wanna take your thumb and you wanna put pressure on those blades and pull towards you, pulling the hairs out. Now you wanna do this underwater and you've got a clean razor head and you can keep going with what you're doing. It's a great hack and works on most any multi-blade I've tried. The Quattro really being, in my opinion, the most cloggy of the blades I've used. I'm going to put a little bit more near hot water on and do a final pass, like a cleanup pass. A little bit more of my Barbasol. With the cleanup pass, I'll do it against the grain. With the multi-blade, you know, you want to limit your, your passes. The Chic Quattro is such a smooth razor, guys. Smooth, irritation free, good grip, nice pivot to the head. Like I said, the only downside was the clogging and I've given you a hack now that will reduce that, that clogging. So now you're set. Only on really on that first long stubble pass with Quattro, guys. You hear the feedback? Oh, that's nice. You can go cross grain and take it up to that goatee. 
pulling to the resistance where you feel those hairs. Do the other side. Ah, uh, yeah, that's nice. Beautiful. And a nice clean head. Sort of like my head. <laughs> it's getting cleaner every, every week. So there you have it, guys. A quick hack to the multi-blade clogging problem that I know all of you have had. So now I'll rinse off with cold water and we'll put the aftershave on. Nice cool spritz. Oh yeah, worry free guys. If you want to get in and go for the little trim here and clean up. You can do that. But I'm content. That looks pretty good. Get the foam out of your ears. Beautiful, beautiful razor that I'm happy I can put back into rotation. Again, if you clog up, take your thumb, press down. You don't want to press up. Press down, put a little pressure on those blades and pull toward you. Like so. Underwater, and it'll pull those clogged hairs out. Go back to one of my favorites, Duke Cannon's Ice Cold Post Shave Bomb. Nice menthol. Ah, oh, yeah. Goes on icy. And then brings a little heat. So you're feeling and looking great. There you go, guys. I'll be back this weekend. We'll probably take the goatee off and start anew. Or maybe I'll go with uh, Tom Selleck or the George Michael. We'll see what we do. As always, I want to thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. But in the meantime, you guys know what to do. Cape! Pushing. <laughs> Keep pushing play, y'all. Now roll the music.